What up YouTube? It's DIY Tech here back with another video. Today we're gonna be doing a fan cleanup and uh, this particular laptop has a fan error message every time I switch it on. Like there. Every time I try to switch it on, it just shows this fan error message and then it goes off. We're going to try and see where that problem is coming from. So let's get into it. So what you're going to want to do first is take off the battery and then unscrew the two screws holding the back plate. Unplug the fan. And then undo the four screws holding down the CPU. At this point you should be able to just wiggle the fan assembly out just like that at this point you can start wiping off the old thermal compound i use uh, some alcohol which makes it easier just make sure to get all of it or as much as you can out Wipe the thermal compound off the heat sink. Now because this computer is showing a fan error message, we can assume there's something wrong with the fan itself. So the first step is to check the actual uh, cables connecting there just to see if everything is still connected properly. And in this case it is. So I'm going to leave that alone. Continue to take apart the fan and heatsink assembly. After it's been taken apart, then I can start uh, going deep with the cleaning, start uh, brushing off all the dust before I use the alcohol on it. Let's dip the brush in a little bit of alcohol to make sure that you get everything, everything is properly cleaned and you should be good. Now 
so after i did this i looked a little bit closer at the fan itself and then on closer inspection i found uh, what was actually causing this fan error problem and this is it right here the screw is uh, wedged in between the, the fan blades and the housing so it's stopping the fan from spinning uh, freely and now as you can see the fan can spin freely so we should be okay now so now all that's left to do is to put everything back together but first i need to finish cleaning the heat sink assembly Then once that's done, it's time to put everything back together. So now that I got uh, the fan and heat sink assembly put back together, I need to put some thermal paste on the CPU before attaching the fan assembly. Yeah, the camera was obstructing my view so i put uh, the thermal paste to the side but it's okay i can just spread it using my uh, plastic tool then we can screw back the fan and heat sink assembly and then before we put everything back together let's just clean off uh, some the excess dust from the back plate back together and we are done so let's 
let's check if it worked and as you can see now it's booting straight into windows we're no longer getting that fan error message so we have done it so job done for the day thank you for watching the video if you liked it please like subscribe and share it with your friends and uh, more videos should be coming very soon have a good one